Every day, thousands of Illinoisans and millions of Americans struggle to obtain life-saving drug treatments due to the skyrocketing cost of insulin, which has more than doubled in the last few years. In recent weeks, I've heard too many heartbreaking stories of constituents paying more than $400 for just one month's supply of this life-saving medicine. Others are forced to make impossible decisions between paying for medicine or paying to repair their car so they can go to work, left with no choice but to ration their treatments and risk their own lives. This is unconscionable. No one should have to choose between taking their medication as prescribed and putting a roof over their head. At a time when Big Pharma is making record profits, we have got to do more to lower costs. Since I came to Congress, I've fought to reduce the cost of prescription drugs so that no one has to make this choice between keeping a roof over their head and food on the table or paying for their medication. I'm so proud that the House just passed the Affordable Insulin Now Act. It capped the out-of-pocket cost of insulin at $35 per month, lowering drug costs for hardworking families facing those skyrocketing insulin costs and other life-saving diabetic treatments. While this is a critical step in the right direction, I'm not going to stop working to ensure that every American has access to affordable prescription medication and quality health care coverage.